How's it going guys and welcome to a top 6 list of heroes that we recommend to new players and beginners. In this video we will be going over how each of the 6 heroes are used and why we think they are great for starters. Number 6, Mercy. Mercy is the most basic healer among all other heroes. She is very team oriented and relies on sticking with them. It is crucial because she has no self defense aside from a tiny pistol. You are strongest when you stick with your team as you have a medigun that helps keep everyone alive. She has some decent mobility as you can dash quickly to your teammate to get out of a sticky situation or to get back into a fight. Her ultimate makes her stand out from all the other characters as it allows her to resurrect nearby allies. It is important to keep track of your ult and even more important not to waste it. Overall, she is a basic healer for starters and very easy to use. Just heal your teammates who are injured and give damage buffs to your carries. Number 5, Reinhard. Reinhard is a typical tank who has a shield that blocks up to 2000 damage for your team. Just stand in front of your team and hold the objective. Aside from that, Reinhard also has a charge that pins one person to the wall and knocks back nearby enemies. This is very powerful but keep in mind that you will still need to protect your team. You also have a ranged attack that has a small cast time before it fires wherever your crosshair is. Reinhardt's ultimate is an amazing AoE crowd control as it sends a cone shaped shockwave in front of him which stuns every enemy caught in the area for 3 seconds. It is important to try to land this on multiple targets. Reinhardt is the go to tank for beginners as he provides plenty of utility for your team. Number 4, Soldier 76. I've got you in my sights. Soldier is your go-to hero if you've ever played any FPS before. If you've played Counter-Strike or Call of Duty, you can easily pick him up. He has a standard assault rifle, preferable at mid to long range. His right click launches helix rockets at your crosshair and deals splash damage. His E lays down a biotic field that heals himself and nearby allies over time. It is important to use it to your advantage. His ultimate is a cheap 8 second aimbot that shoots targets near your crosshair. It is used best to take out enemy healers and squishies such as Airborne Pharah or Lethal Widowmaker. Victory. Number 3, Lucio. Lucio is a healer just like Mercy, but unlike Mercy, he has a AoE heal instead of single target heal and a speed boost instead of damage buffs. His shift switches between two songs that give him and nearby allies buffs. One does healing over time and the other gives bonus movement speed. His E simply amplifies his song for a short period of time. His right click is a knockback that sends enemies flying back. It's fun to use this to push people off the cliff of certain maps. His ultimate is sound barrier that gives all nearby allies a gigantic shield that diminishes over time. He's easy because he can heal and provide damage at the same time. Also, he can run on walls. Number 2, Bastion. Bastion is a robot that can transform into a turret mounted with a minigun that holds 200 bullets. He is looted while transformed, but provides an extremely high amount of damage. His E is a repair that heals himself. This can be used in both humanoid and turret form. If you can find a good spot to camp, you can simply point and click to get the play of the game. If that's still not enough damage for you, you can pop your ultimate which transforms you into a tank. A literal tank. While in tank form, you can move freely and fire cannons. They do crazy amounts of AoE damage and will destroy everything that stands in your way. Number 1. Torbjorn. Torbjorn is the easiest hero in the game hands down. It's good for newbies that aren't confident in their aiming skill but still wish to deal damage for your team. Your shift lays down a sentry that automatically aims at targets within a 40 yard range. You can switch to your hammer by pressing 2 to build or repair your sentry. Your sentry will go up to a maximum of 2 levels and another level when you pop your ultimate Molten Core. During Molten Core, Torbjorn and his sentry gains tons of health, damage, and attack speed. In some situations, you can use your ultimate as an oh shit button to heal yourself and your sentry back to full. 
Aside from the sentry, Torbjorn has a scrap gun that shoots a single bullet or can be used as a shotgun. His E drops down a shield that can be picked up by you or an ally. It grants 75 bonus armor. To use this, you will need iron scraps. You collect iron scraps from everything that dies on the battlefield. This has been the 6 easiest heroes that we recommend for beginners of Overwatch. Thank you for watching and please leave a like and subscribe to our channel. If you have any questions, please leave it down in the comment section below. I'll see you all next time. Look at you!